Okay, that was a Del Baduna player analysis on the new Alessandro Florenzi flashback player. So let's jump straight into this here then and start rating this card. So he is 5 for 8, high high, 3 star, 5 star, right foot and explosive. He can play centre mid and right back. We'll be discussing whether he fits into that role in just a second. Uh, and also what position he plays best. Uh, but in terms of links, we've got good there with Milan, Syria and Italy. So let's have a look at his stats then and decide which position he fits into best. So he has got 90 shooting there, but the attack position and finishing in great. I'm guessing that's because his moments was him scoring a volley or something, because he's got 96 long shots, 97 shot power and 99 volleys. Uh, let's have a look, actually, quickly. Uh, well, memorable goal against Barcelona. But he has got really, really good pace there. 94 acceleration, 87 sprint speed. That's going to be good. Shooting is okay. It's not 90, though, boys. Like, don't assume that. Um, it's not like it's going to be uh, out of this world because of that 84 finishing and 82 attack positioning. He will just be banging at volleys and long shots, really. Uh, passing's good. That's great passing. I don't mind that. That'll do. Dribbling, amazing. Look at that. 99 agility, 95 balance, 97 reactions, 90 ball control. Yeah, good. Defending's good. Physicality is amazing. 99 aggression. Okay, what we got here then? Dead ball, ping pass plus, whip pass, slide tackle, bruise, anticipate plus, intercept and a block. So a really, really nice card there. Um, in terms of the right back position, I think he will do a job there, but I think there's definitely better cards for the price of this SBC. And talking about the price of this SBC, I think he's a really good centre mid, by the way. I'll add that, and I think, uh, yeah, the price of the SBC is an 85 and an 87. No team of the weeks, um, and he will be there whilst team of the season is live. So what I would do, boys, I'd wait until team of the season live comes out, see what SBCs they drop for that, and then decide according to that. Um, because I feel it, it's a good card, um, but with team of the season coming, there's going to be so many better cards, uh, and yeah, it's probably not worth doing any SBCs at the moment, but it is a very nice card, boys, I won't lie.